In this episode, a poster of the planned Rolling Stones tour hangs on the wall of Lisa's room with her husband in 2010. Thus, the cartoon predicted that the band would last at least another decade, maybe more. In fact, that's what happened. They were preparing a farewell tour in 2010, but didn't actually do it until November 2012. And it was not the last tour. When Lisa went to London, a building was shown behind Tower Bridge, which is exactly the same design and location as the actual shard skyscraper that appeared. The project was designed in 2000 by architect Renzo Piano. In 2007, its construction began and was completed in 2012. A dubious but fairly accurate match in the design of the iPod style intercom. The canonical Apple player with this design was released on October 23, 2001. Technically, Ebola was discovered in Africa in 1976, but it did not become widespread in the media and the world until 2014. In 1998, it was also talked about in The Simpsons. Continuing the theme of the future from The Simpsons, one cannot ignore the appearance of video communication technology. Lisa communicates with Marge in this way from her landline phone. The popularity of the technology in smartphones came after the release of FaceTime in 2010. But in fact, the first phonoscope concepts were shown by a T&T Bell Labs at the Picture Phone Show in 1960. In this episode, Bart stands next to a magazine advertising $9 tickets in front of the Twin Towers. Together they form the date 9.11. In addition, Lisa has a triangle of hair sticking out, which many researchers associate with the Pyramid of the All-Seeing Eye. And in Bart's hand is a bill bearing a symbol reminiscent of Freemason money. In fact, there are many hints of an impending terrorist attack in this series, from the production number of the series to references to Jesus and the Pentagon. Two Japanese men working in a juicer factory are packaging a box of goods for the people of Springfield. One of them sneezes, causing a dangerous virus to enter the package. Now a coronavirus is raging in China and is spreading to the rest of the world. However, it is not transmitted through packages from China if epidemiologists are to be believed, so this coincidence is a bit dubious. At the entrance to the Ginormous Pictures movie studio hangs two posters, the seventh episode of Star Wars and the third part of Alvin and the Chipmunks. This hints at the simultaneous release of the novelties on the big screen. In fact, that's what happened, but the creators of The Simpsons got it a little wrong. Along with the seventh episode came the fourth part of The Chipmunks. During the school children's tour of the nuclear power plant, a mutant fish with three eyes appears in the pond. This was the very first mention of such a living creature. 21 years later, three Argentinian fishermen caught the same fish near the city of Cordoba on Lake Choro de Aquacalian, not far from the local nuclear power plant, which, like in the cartoon, was dumping waste into the reservoir. Bart creates a group called Crowd Hooligans with you. S. Navy money and shoots a clip of them hitting Arab soldiers from you. S. Planes. At one point, a bomb falls on a Syrian opposition SUV with a very similar Syrian opposition flag painted on the door. Plus, the episode showed a fighter jet with a license plate containing two of the same letters PP. A few years later, the U.S. Army had the FF-22 aircraft. If you flip the letters from the series, you get BB, which in numerical terms is 22. 